what's going on everybody so i get this question a lot uh, a lot of people ask me how hard it is to actually pack a parachute this video will be about how to pack a parachute some tips and guidelines and whatnot it's really not that hard you could really do it yourself it always works best if you got a second person to help you with it to, to hold the spring in while you're strapping uh, the loops and everything one thing i could tell you is during the winter during the off season or if your car is going to sit for weeks at a time without racing take your parachute out you know just set it in the back of the car whatever a lot of the time these strings they love to memory up and when they memory up like that sometimes the chute won't deploy when you go to actually pull the rip cord out of it and causes a, a non-deployment issue also a lot of moisture will be stuck in the pack especially if you leave your car in the trailer over the winter or you know where there's a lot of humidity or or whatnot so so you know with this video i'm gonna get the uh the parachute out of the uh deployment bag put it out on the ground straighten it up and show you guys how to do this so let's get to it okay so you know typically when you're done with the pass you, you get out of the car and you get out and your parachutes out there looking like this so the best thing to do here is to Stroud's actually done a pretty good job and they left this white tab on there and I'll show you what that white tab actually does so usually what I'll do is I'll, I'll start back here I'll make sure that these are all nice and snug in there and they're nice and straight and not tangled up inside the uh, bridle cord and then come up to that tag and I'll grab that one tag and then I'll just basically follow it all the way back to the chute or the canopy is what they call it. And boom, it's all, it's all untangled. It's all straightened up and everything. So the next thing I do here is I'll find, you know, you got four strands here. I go to each corner just like this, I'll pull it tight, take my second finger, and then I'll find the next one here. And then I'll take my another finger, just like that, fold it, and then fold it one more time. Now I grab the deployment bag or what other people call it. They call it the D-bag. Yes, the D-bag. <laughs> so what you're gonna do, you're gonna S-fold this thing in. I usually have a flap on the side. Either side, it doesn't matter. I'll go ahead and start S-folding this in. Pulling it taut the whole time. And S-folding it as I'm shoving it into the, what they call the D bag. <laughs> Sometimes it can be a D bag, if you know what I mean. So basically we just get it all packed in there, nice and straight. And then I'm just gonna grab the cords and pull back on the car as, as tight as I can. And I just start pulling forward. Now, it doesn't matter if it's starting to overfill the bag once you get up to the bridle cord then you could straighten everything out in the bag but everything gets s folded just like that everything's in there now you just got to tuck everything in And then it's going to go into the chute pack that way. So that's the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to get it into the into the chute pack here. So let's go ahead and start with that. Okay, now we got our uh, deployment bag all stuffed together and all ready to go back into the chute pack here. 
So get everything straightened up. We got our string and our loop here. I'm gonna start at the top, but let's get this uh, shoot pack in. It's gonna go in just like this. So and then we got our spring cord here. And this is when it comes in handy to have two people. I got my wife here. She's gonna push in the spring for me while I uh, get all the, the loops in. Tuck everything in. Just like that grab your your string and we're gonna go down straight down to the first one here loop it in pull it up tight hold it tight and then we're gonna go okay so whichever side your cord is actually on that's the side that's gonna be first so we're gonna go this direction I could get my string here straightened up. Feed the string through the hole. Then you're gonna pull it tight again. Are you tucking everything? And then you're gonna go over to the last one over here on this side. And then you're gonna take your cord. you're gonna shove it through and your chute is packed now you tuck up everything make it nice and make it look nice and pretty and you're gonna take your cord you're gonna move it to the back side so there's no tension on it and then you're just gonna pull it right out so it doesn't burn the cord then you can take your bridal cord and pull out however much you want um, I typically don't like that much pulled out but that'll work so that's how you pack a parachute if you guys learned something from this enjoyed it like subscribe leave a comment down below and we will see you again